this thing on? Is this even, is this thing, is this thing on? this is this hi um hola guten tag konnichiwa bonjour buongiorno god morgen and how you doing y'all hi i'm robbie i'm your vlog host for this evening and well every vlog i am going to be traveling the world for one year i have a project called four sides of a coin you can read more about it in the description below i'll give you a quick summary i'm going to write a book uh, create a film and uh, make a soundtrack to go with the film and all that kind of good stuff over one year while I'm traveling. So one week from now, I'm leaving England. Um, I've quit my job, I've sold my apartment, and then I'm traveling for a whole year. And the reason why four sides of a coin, why not three, why not 10, whatever? Well, I'm gonna live in four different countries um, over the space of a year. Uh, why four different countries? Well, because I think if you wanna really learn from places, um, you need to spend more than one or two weeks there. You know, if you want to meet people and really kind of have them trust you and you know share feelings, emotions, and you know how they are and all this kind of good stuff, you really need to stay there for longer and have people get to know you and you get to know them. So I figured about three months in each place is kind of a decent amount of time to kind of get to know a place properly and hopefully get to know its people a bit better. And my plan for the book film, you see, is exactly that. I want to learn people's human values. I want to learn what makes people happy in the morning, what makes them worry, what they hope to achieve in the next few years or the rest of their life, what they think is uh, considered enough for them to be happy with their life, what they're reaching for, what their dreams are, how they think they might achieve them. And if I can kind of document that by film and book from four different places around the world, then I think there's going to be some contrast of, you know, maybe in America they want this or have these priorities. Maybe in Cambodia, second place I'm going to, America's the first. Um, and maybe in Cambodia they have so many different priorities and concerns, you know. And then maybe in India, you know, some different ones, and maybe in Africa, or wherever I end up. But this is kind of the idea, is that then I have this book and film outlining all these different contrasts of people's interests. Actually, Jasmine, what are we doing today? What are we doing today? We are jumping off a cathedral. This is correct. So today we're going to be jumping off a cathedral. <laughs> So, Jasmine and I are about to climb down this building right here. Are you going to be alive? Yeah, we're going to be alive. We're yeah, going to live this. We're going to do we're this. We're going to do this. We're going to do this, baby. We're going to die. Right now, um, I'm trying to find Alex. My buddy uh, Alex has come to visit for a couple of days to kind of hang out before we, um, before I go to New York next week. So we're gonna try and find him here at the train station and see where he's hiding. So I think I have found an Alex. He's hiding right behind, look at that jump. So Alex here is uh, looking for some summer clothes because he's going to be going to Spain, soon to Barcelona. We've got a full-on gringo collection right here. <laughs> <laughs> These are the clothes you wear if you want to get stabbed in Rio. Um, anything sort of tickle your fancy? Anything standing out to you? I mean, it's all standing out to me because it's all extremely 
bright. <laughs> Alex is trying on the Rio Cartel hat. Here he goes. It looks really nice. Yeah, you look like one of those um, Guns N' Roses session musicians they use. <laughs> How you digging the skins? It's a very sexual shirt. <laughs> it is. I feel like I should be uh, singing in the hot chocolate or something like that. <laughs> I believe in miracles. Way far. It's the Primark pimp. <laughs> Les a compétent. Do you like Coventry, Alex? Love Coventry. Yeah, do you like it? Think it's nice. Sweet. Where are we right now? Cathedral. Is there anything special about this cathedral? What's missing? The roof. Yes, correct. There is no roof on Coventry Cathedral because it was bombed during the Second World War. History lesson for the day over. And out. Hey cutie. Okay, so there is your edited picture for now. And I'll email that across. Alex has just been to the bathroom. How was that, Alex? Was that nice? Release the demons. Release the demons. <laughs> How beautiful. Alex, yes. what one piece of advice would you give me uh, for traveling the world for the next year? One piece of advice? Mm-hmm. I'd say I'd I mean, you can make it too. <laughs> <laughs> I'd say show them everything that you are mm. to the fullest. Yes. Because we all know what you are. What am I? <laughs> what am I, Alex? Uh? What am I? You are eccentric. <laughs> <laughs> That'll do. And, <laughs> and show them the best that we have of our culture as well. Okay. Because they're showing you their best. Okay. Jasmine, how excited are you to watch the first little draft of the, of the vlog? Yeah? Really excited? So yeah. excited you've even paused eating your biscuit. Do you want to yeah, continue eating it? You don't have to not eat. There you go. Do you feel more comfortable <laughs> eating the biscuit? <laughs> Do you feel more comfortable throwing it all down yourself? <laughs> you really need to stay there for longer and have people get to know you and you get to know them. And you liked it? Yeah. Yay. Yay! 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 Can we get a hell yeah? Hell yeah! So when we went shopping, Instead of putting all the stuff away in all the different places, I kept out the stuff for tonight's dinner separate because I'm cooking and let's make life easy. That's what life's all about, make life easy. And voila! How organised is that? Here we go, we're just going to chop these tomatoes here. As you can see, it's really important to get a very small knife to, to chop these so you don't cut your fingers or anything and it's much simpler with a, a nice small knife. Just something, anything smaller and this or a little bit bigger is fine. Um, maybe you could use an axe, you know, that always kind of works for me. <laughs> um, or perhaps, I don't know, something bigger than an axe, like a sword. So th this also works, this is a, another good tool, especially for tomatoes of this size, when they're really this, you know, pretty large ones, you've really got to uh, get into the nitty gritty of these. And uh, as you can see, it counts like a knife. Anymore. The kids on the corner are still knocking at your door. Do you like uh, vegan food, Jasmine? Yeah, I love vegan food. Does your uncle cook pretty good? Pretty good. Is he pretty multi-talented? Pretty multi-talented. Yeah, pretty and multi-talented. Is that what you said? Yeah, definitely. Pretty and multi-talented. I like it. Under secret sedation, you just stare at the wall. It's the curse of creation, there you rise and you fall. Is it nice? Mm -hmm. Is it good? Very good? Very good. Out of 10? We can go up to 11. We can... Oh, I was enthusiasm for a minute ago. <laughs> boom, snap, clap, boom, snap, clap. Which one do you want me to have? That one. Okay, and why do you want me to have that one? Because then we'll have one each. Ah, oh, super cute. Thelma, 
You look like a little boy, boy. <laughs> you look like a little cat, baby. Oh, man. What ship is that one? Millennium Falcon. Millennium Falcon. It's the best ship in the world, right? Mm. Is it the fastest ship in the galaxy? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Are we having movie time right now? Yeah. Yeah. And what are we going to watch? Mega Mind. Mega Mind. Arty, you comfortable? Yeah. Who's the best babysitter in the world? Me. I don't know. Are you supposed to say Uncle Rob? Oh, Uncle Rob! Uncle Rob! Jack! Jack! Come back, Jack! Come back! Come back! Come back, Jack! Near far, wherever you are, I am right at my heart does go What would be the one piece of advice you would give yourself either towards the people you meet or for yourself for your experience i suppose with where, you, where you're going with the film and the book and everything it it's really soaking up those cultures and really hearing those stories i think the trouble is we all, we all have a subtext and we all have a, we all project our own story or our own experiences onto things and actually being able to really go in and really soak, soak a culture up really hear their story really catch their story i think that's that'd be really interesting I mean, that's obviously what you're aiming to do and i think that will that would be really interesting to see see you come back with stories that have, are untold those that are missed um so so go and capture those and i look forward to seeing them i suppose what do you mean you suppose <laughs> <laughs> um firstly i would say um, be prepared to be surprised by people, so don't take any stereotypes with you, but just be open to surprises. Remember to rest. Okay. <laughs> to take some rest, because that's partly why you're doing it, and to enjoy it, to enjoy it. Yeah. Mm. Um, ah, yes, you're doing, you're doing this, and this is great and creative, but sometimes step away from the lens, step away from behind the lens, because sometimes the best memories are just absorbing all those senses and everything, and just storing those memories. Absolutely. That's, that's what I would say. Perfect. And so with that last thought in mind, I am going to switch this thing off now for the last weekend I have at home and spend it with my family. Um, so I hope you enjoyed the first vlog. Um, if you like it, stick a thumbs up. Um, subscribe for future vlogs. And I'll try and get one out to you next week from New York. So have a great weekend and a great week. And I'll see you from New York. Bye. You just